Buff Friends, Dapper Drabby here, and welcome to another day. Ooh, I knew that was going to happen. Bump another camera. But today, we are going to go ahead and open up uh, the rest of our World Championship decks. We have two of them here, and that is Ice Path for the win from Zachary Bukhardi and uh, Samurai Sniper from Kabu Fukase. Uh, so, we're going to see what's in these guys. It's going to be a Decidueye vs. Ninetales matchup here. I'm going to open up in this video, and then we'll also post another video at the same time featuring these two facing off against each other. So let's go ahead and put Samurai Sniper back there. We will open up uh, Zachary's Ice Path for the Wind first. And uh, these things come with everything the same as the last thing. You know, it says, uh, play like a champion. Gives you a little blurb about Zachary here, um, which I guess I should have run. Earned his world championship title in the senior division with a water type deck featuring a Lolan Ninetales GX, assisted by Aqua Patch to power up the rough seas to heal to heal the whole team. The star brings <laughs> the star Pokemon brings some nice versatility with three attacks. Uh with three attacks that do different things. Ice Blade can snipe opponent's bench. Blizzard Edge can, is an immensely powerful punch. And Ice Path can be a huge swing, moving all damage counters from Alola Ninetales to your opponent. So here's the basic deck list. Uh, it has three Ninetales GX, four Alolan Volpixes, two Octillery, two Emeraid, two uh, Tapu Lele GXs, one Tapu Coco, one Sudowoodo, one Giratina for that uh, Greninja matchup. Aqua Patch is four of them. Bridget is one of them. Three choice bands. A field blower, floatstone, Guzma, Karen, and and all the rest of this stuff down there. And uh, we will go ahead and like flip through it real fast. But like I said, um, it also comes with the booklet. I love this booklet. It shows you like little pictures, but all booklets are the same. So we've gone. We went through that in the last one. We won't really need to go through it in this one. Basically, it has pictures of the event, has uh, pictures of the champions with their decks, and stuff like that. Uh, it doesn't have any pictures of uh, Kabu, but uh, that happens. So, apparently, the two big here are Tapu Koko and uh, that ice path for the win, Alolan Ninetales. So, Alolan Ninetales... Pretty cool card, 210 HP, and has those three attacks that are crazy good. And apparently he's partnering up with Tapu Koko. Sorry for the blurriness. And then we have a pin, like we did last time. I like that pin a lot. And then we have the deck. Bridget, a must in any evolution deck. Um, evolution heavy deck, I should say. Get that plastic off of there. Has Kukui, Sycamore, Rough Seas, because it was still legal at the time. Via Seeker, still legal at that time. And, of course, a Water Energies. It comes with a cool little deck box. This one happens to be a light blue, I guess, for the water type. Alola Ninetales. Sudowoodo, Giratina. The best card right here. Lolan Vulpix. Some Rage, Lele's, and all that jazz. And actually here, you guys can have this code. It'll give you some sleeves uh, and stuff like that. Uh, I don't need this many of them, so I'll go ahead and take this one. So that, in a nutshell, is Ninetales GX. And of course, we can fit all this in here. But we will get these things uh, shuffled up because right now they're in an unshuffled mode. So you can count, make sure you have everything, I guess. Um, but we'll go ahead and get nine tails shuffled up and get set up for the matchup. But let's go ahead and get Kabu opened up here. And hopefully it'll open up easily. And this is the Samurai Sniper. Let's go ahead and read the back. Play like a champion with Samurai Sniper. Decidueye GX, Star Tricks, Rowlet, Galissapod, Wimpod, a uh, couple Lele's, 
Espeon, Sudowo, that's a lot of Pokemon. And then the big one right in this deck is Forest of Giant Plants. Before it was banned, it was, was used to boost up Decidueye. But instead of the Vileplume uh, item lock, Kabu chose to use that new Golisopod for some big damage. So this is a junior semi-finalist. Popular Decidueye deck got one last hurrah at Worlds before... The essential forest of giants plants rotated out and got banned. Uh, Kabu gave the the best showing, achieving top four in juniors division. Um, the addition of Galisopod GX gives this ability focused deck a powerful attacker for the active spot. While the Sidewide GX can keep the shadows of the bench and pick off the opposing team with Feather Arrow. Um, I like this deck. That's a really cool idea that Kabu put together. Bringing uh, the Sidueye with Galisopod, like uh, like it said before, Force of Giant Plants rotated out, and then I added and uh, got banned because in expanded it was just going to be too much. Every Grass type being able to evolve like that, and there's another pen. We got our two big hitters here, the Sidueye. And Espeon. The reason why Espeon is a big hitter in this deck is because um, you Feather Arrow, get spread some damage, and then you de-evolve your opponent's Pokemon. And if they have, you know, the uh, example, 210 HP um, Ninetales, and then you get three Feather Arrows off on it, the Vulpix only has 60 HP, so you can de-evolve it with miraculous shine here and then uh get a knockout and take away their Vulpix to be able to evolve so you got Sudowoodo, Float Stones, the big card right here, Force of Giant Plants two years in a row was it printed for this uh for these world championship decks because it's just that good that they printed it again I think last year they it was printed in um Jesper Erickson's deck, the Bebe deck with uh, Yen Mega and uh, what was it? Yen Mega and Vioplume. I still have that deck floating around here somewhere, and that was I liked that deck a lot too. I think I just like Forest of Giant Plants. <laughs> so of course here's the rest of the deck. We got the Galissapod, which is good for that first impression attack. Um, so I could see why this deck, and you know, I think if, if Forest didn't rotate out, this deck would probably still be floating around, because the ability to evolve Decidueye, um, turn one is just too good to pass up, um, I mean, people still play Decidueye, they still try to make it work, um, I think there's a Decidueye Zoroark going around. But it's just not as strong as Decidueye was in its prime with Forest of Giant Plants. So thank you guys so much for coming out. I will get these two shuffled up and we are going to have a bit of a battle against each other. We got Ice Path for the win versus Samurai Sniper. So tune in for that and I will see you guys on the next video. This has been Dapper Jari. I hope you guys are Lola and I hope to see you later. Bye bye.